Hello, everybody. My name is Roy Nemer of MundalbiCeleste.com. Happy New Year. I hope everybody had a very, very happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year. Happy 2022. It's good to be back. And we got some news for you. Got some news for you today. Lionel Messi, World Cup qualifiers, Lionel Scaloni, a lot of stuff to go through. Let's get to it. First things first, Lionel Messi, there are rumors that he will not be called up to the Argentina national team for the January slash February World Cup qualifying matches. Now, Argentina play Chile away at the end of the month, and then they host Colombia at home in the beginning of February. And those are two matches that Lionel Messi might not make. There were some reports, some rumors going around uh, earlier in the week that Lionel Scaloni, the coach, will be making a couple of changes to the squad uh, to his call-ups this time around for a couple of different reasons. So the first reason obviously being that, hey, the pressure is kind of off. Argentina have qualified for the World Cup. That's the first reason. Second reason is a little bit to do with the clubs slash the players as well. And, you know, it's no secret that 2021, at one point, there was a big, big struggle uh, between the national teams and the clubs, right? More specifically, maybe the Premier League at one point. For example, if we take a look at the matches in September, Argentina, Brazil, that got postponed. Uh, the Premier League did not want to release the players. Ultimately, some of the players said, you know what? Forget about it. We're going, we're going to travel. And Scaloni, from what's being reported, from what we're hearing, doesn't want to have that problem. So everyone that's kind of, you know, battling fitness, for example, uh, possibly Christian Romero, this is just an example I'm giving, doesn't mean that Romero will or will not be called up. But as an example, maybe someone like Christian Romero, who's just about to come back from injury for Tottenham, you know, he might not be called up. Uh, someone else, maybe playing in England, maybe playing in Europe, someone that's a regular starter might not get called up. You know why? Hey, we don't want any problems with uh, with the clubs. So let's rest the players and we're going to call up some domestic base players, some local base players. And that's the word going around. So the word going around is that Scaloni is going to call up a lot of defenders, a lot of midfielders from the domestic league uh, who we don't know yet. Uh, no clue whatsoever as to who could or will get called up from the domestic league from Argentina. But that's the general idea going around right now is that Scaloni might not call up some of the regulars uh, for those reasons that I mentioned, obviously qualified already for the World Cup and doesn't want any problems uh, with any of the clubs. So we might be getting uh, a lot more local base players this time around than European. Now, the big news is, hey, where does this leave Lionel Messi, right? The captain, best player in the world. Does he get called up? Does he not? And according to reports going around uh, out of Argentina, Scaloni does not want to call him up. He wants to rest him. And apparently there was a chat between the, the staff itself and Messi, and they told him, look, we're not really looking to call you up this time around. Get some rest. Stay with PSG. Apparently, Messi told him, look, give me a couple of days. We'll see what gives. and I'll, I'll make my decision. And we're kind of waiting on that. We are all waiting on that. Uh, for Lionel Messi, for example, he hasn't missed a single match, a single match for Argentina since 2019. And even those matches, uh, they were forced because he was suspended uh, after the match Argentina versus, uh, you know, versus Brazil at Copa America in 2019. Messi came out and he made some big comments, some big, big comments uh, against uh, Conmebol. Uh, and that ultimately got him suspended. So he missed four matches. He missed a match against Chile. Uh, all, all of these were friendly matches. So Chile, uh, Mexico, Germany, and uh, and Ecuador was the fourth. Two wins, two draws out of them. So the team looked good without Messi. Uh, and that was the last time Messi did not play for Argentina. So over two years ago now, about 15, 16 months ago, was the last time Argentina played without Lionel Messi. Could it happen this time around? It could. It possibly could. Uh, my personal guess is I think Messi sits this one out. This is my guess. This is my guess. Let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think Messi sits this one out? And do you guys want Messi to sit this one out? Personally speaking, I would rest him, 
It's enough travels. Obviously, he has nothing to prove. It's been several years. He has nothing to prove to anyone. But let him rest. You know, he's coming back from COVID and he had that injury against Venezuela that kind of kept him out of the match a little bit uh, versus Uruguay. He did not start that match in the qualifiers. So let him rest. Try someone else, someone like Dybala. For me, this is the perfect opportunity. And for whatever reason, we keep saying this. Like This match coming up, this is Dybala's perfect opportunity to shine and everything. But you know what? If Messi is not called up, this is it. This is make or break for Paulo Dybala, in my opinion. Uh, and I know I'm getting ahead of myself. For all we know, Messi might get called up and he might end up playing 90 minutes in both matches. But taking a step back, looking at it, I think he doesn't get called up. He doesn't get called out, called up to the team, sorry. I think Dybala does, and let's see what Dybala could do. This is, in my opinion, again, put up or shut up for Dybala. I love the guy. I want him to succeed in the team. I think he could be a great asset, be it in the starting 11 or coming off the bench. And you know what? If Messi's not there, this is his. this could be his time to shine. This could really, really be his time to shine. So that's my opinion. That's the news coming out of Argentina. We could get a couple of changes and we'll see what gives uh, regarding Messi and regarding everybody else. So let me know, leave a comment. What do you guys think? Uh, well, what do you guys think of this video? Let me know uh, and hit that like button if you haven't already. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already either. It's greatly appreciated. And yeah, let me know what you guys think. Uh, would you rest up a lot of the regulars? Would you include Messi? Would you include you know some of the others? Uh, Lotaro Martinez or something like that or or would you go with maybe some other players let me know leave a comment love to read it um, and this is this is it this was it for this video once more my name is Roy Nemmer of MundoAlbiSelesia.com thank you for watching and be safe goodbye everybody